Hi, I'm Dave Epstein. This is Growing Wisdom. And you go out to a nursery and you see a lot of soil stuff, bags and bags of it, and you might be a little confused. What do you use where? What's planting mix? What's compost? What about topsoil? peat moss, all those things. Well, a couple of different reasons you may be buying soil. One is you want to put stuff in containers, and for that you have container mix. And container mix is a little bit lighter. It tends to have lighter components in it, so when you put it in things like a window box or a whiskey barrel, it's not as heavy. And that's really good for the annuals and any of the other flowers that you might be putting in those window boxes. What about when you're planting a tree or a shrub or other perennials? Then you have complete planting mixes, and those planting mixes come in all sorts of different forms and varieties, and the planting mixes are basically peat, compost, and topsoil mixed together in the right ratios for you. One of the things you want to do always is mix in some of the existing soil that you have in the ground around those. Now, you can make your own mixes. You take three components, compost, peat, and topsoil, mix them together, a third, a third, and a third, mix them well, and you have your own soil. And that's kind of a neat thing to do as well at your own house if you don't want to buy one of the pre-made mixes and it's a little bit less expensive. So we really can boil all of these bags down to three different options. Container mix for those containers, planting mix for putting it right in the ground, or making your own with compost, topsoil, and peat. That's it. So don't be overwhelmed by all the bags you see behind me. Think about what your project is, choose what you need, and you'll be good to grow. Come back every week for all of our tips, hints, and helps here at Growing Wisdom.